these are you know, vague buzzwords, but they are the, the types of skills that we look for. Um, the live operations piece we've talked about a lot, right? The ability to day in and day out manage a game as a service. Uh, innovation, I'm not necessarily talking you know, the explosive, crazy innovation, oh, I'm gonna create a brand new game because it is very rare that you'll actually be able to create a game from scratch. Um, some of that is helpful because it gives you outside the box thinking. But there's also a lot of innovation that you can do inside the box. Strategy, you know, the, the, this big picture type of thinking, I mentioned that you get to be a product owner rather than just focused on a, a small step. So being able to step back and say, you know, I'm, I'm tuning some content here that will impact the players that have played for a year or more. How will that impact the players who start today? Analytical skill set, again, super important because again, we get more and more numbers. You have more and more companies dabbling in, in machine learning. Um, super, super impactful stuff, super interesting stuff. If you can't keep up, it will be challenging. Um, player focus. This is the one that people forget a lot about. You are dealing with, um, you know, not real life problems in a sense, but you're dealing with real human beings playing this game. More importantly, you're not one of them. Don't ever think that as a player of your own game, you understand what your players look for or want.